What's up YouTube? This is Chris with Sage Films and another After Effects CS4 tutorial. In this tutorial, I'll be teaching you guys how to replace the sky in Call of Duty 4 or any real-time footage. So go ahead and open up the program. Go ahead and import your file, which I'm pretty sure everybody should know how to do. And just import your video. I'm using a Call of Duty 4 clip, which you've probably seen in my sky replacement tests. You've probably seen it there. And just go to where you want the sky replacement to start, which is right now for me, 9 frames. Okay, now once you have it where you want to start, go to Effect, go to Color Correction, and go to Colorama. And what this does, it distincts the colors out from everything else. Now, as you can see, the sky right here is red and kind of a pink. And if you look on the gun, there's pink there, and there's here. So we don't want that, because this is basically what our green screen is going to be. And this is where the picture or the fractal noise effect is going to be so you don't want that so I'll show you how to fix that later so what you're going to do right now is open the output cycle go to the preset and go to ramp gray then you'll go to effect king color key take the eyedropper and select the sky go to color tolerance and it's going to be somewhere around 45 it might be more it might be less just mess around with it until you get what you want and make sure you have an edge feather of around 2 or 3 and that just kinda blurs it so it doesn't look as uh, pixelated around the edges of the buildings and stuff like that okay now what you're gonna do is you're gonna do layer new solid and this is where we're gonna create our green screen as you see I have green selected just make it your comp size and click OK as you see this covers this so drag this under your clip and there we go there's our green screen Okay, now what we're going to do is we're going to have what well, we want an image in the back. So drag it back to the top, or if you want to leave it at the bottom, just click this little eye right here and it'll make that footage disappear for now. So I'm going to go ahead and just drag this to the top. I find it a lot easier. I'm going to go ahead and input our JPEG file. So import and import this cloud. And just drag it right on your green screen and just make it big and drag it to where you want and then make sure you drag both of these to the bottom but make sure rain is above the green screen so it shows up kinda like this now what I would do right now is select both of these control shift C to create them into a complete composition by themselves that way if you need to do any editing afterwards like uh, like the rain or like weather change and that's you'll need to have this in a separate composition and so yeah that's pretty much how you create sky replacement with color d4 it's simple it's easy and i hope you guys enjoy this tutorial thanks